ready? I spent four twenty-five on this unit for a maybe Gucci. So my brother and I are gonna go take a look and see if it's real. This is what I wanted to check out. Gucci. You know what? That says Coach. Coach. All right. That's not real. You get in trouble for selling. Yeah. Bootleg, and so it's really nothing. Yeah. Worthless. So much for the Gucci. Looks like I'm gonna have to pull a profit out of this unit one dollar at a time. Is that like all the shoes here? Probably $40 worth of shoes here. And here's the remotes for the TVs. Yeah, this is like $20. There's a remote. Backpack, another 10 bucks on this. Oh, Pyrex dish. Those are always good. That's $10 each. And there's one. Oh, here's a bigger one. Those are good. Nice crystal. And they're $15 there for the set. Hey, look. This is Waterford. Ah, that's nice. Nice tumblers. Yep. About 40 bucks right here. Because they're at least $10 each. And then there's a bunch of CDs in here. About 30. So 30 times, I get three bucks a piece for them. About 90 so. bucks or so. Oh, they love jerseys. Jerseys is $10. Mm -hmm. Hey, what is this? Bunch Buff, of belt buckles. Belt buckles. No silver ones. It's five bucks each. Oh, this is bad. Oh. Oh, wow. What is that? That's the whole room right there. Yeah, it is. Yeah. This thing's old. It's heavy. It's got weight to it. So you put a flint in here? We got to get that checked out for sure. This must get better be real, or else I'm going backwards on this unit. Hi, Jeff. Yeah. I'm Nabila. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I've got this thing here. I buy storage units. Mm -hmm. Okay. I have never, in 20 years I've been doing this, found one of these. Okay. Uh, they started making these somewhere around the 1600s, you know, the pretty neat old guns. It's also a flintlock. It's, what does that mean? You would put a piece of flint in here. Right. When you pull the trigger, this would come down. Your flint would scratch across here charging your powder inside here and sending your ball on its way. You okay. know, Captain Cook would have been real proud to have this. So like a pirate's gun? Yeah, exactly. If this was an original from the 1600s, it would be somewhere between 2,000 and all the way up to maybe 20, 25,000. Well, that's sounding good. Did you see the writing on the side? Well, what hey. that says is High Hunter, Hollywood, California. High Hunter was a guy that had these guns made in the 1960s. Okay, it's called the Buccaneer. What you have here is a good, solid, small boat anchor. <laughs> yeah, this is a good, no, oh, maybe 100 bucks. So hopefully you didn't pay a lot for the unit or yet. This was my... Well, if this was your coup de gras, yeah. you need to get some more de gras. I should have known. The Gucci's a fake, the musket's a fake. What are you gonna do? I'm not going out with a big bang here today, huh? Well, you can go out with a big bang. You just ain't going out with any money. Yeah. Hear me? Yeah. I may not have a lot of friends, but I got a lot of money. King of the world!